confidence. What'd you say? Here's the deal. You have a way of talking to yourself. We all do. That's your conscious mind, by the way. That's the conversation we have internally. Uh, when people say, hey, do you hear voices? I say, damn right I do. It's mine. I hope you got one of those going on also. It's the part of you right now that's saying, hey, does Ken know what he's talking about? I mean, I know he's been doing this 20 years and all this great stuff, but is he smart enough to give me a little nugget of information? It's the part of you that's noticing how cool this microphone is and the light behind me and saying those things as soon as I say it. Yeah, he's right. Yeah, he's right. Yeah, he's right. That's the conscious mind. Well, you have some control over the conscious mind. You know, as a hypnotherapist, I deal with the unconscious. I help people change the deep level stuff, but I also give my clients something they got to do for themselves, homework, as it were, things that they can do. And one of those things that you can do is figure out how you're talking to yourself and most importantly, what you're saying. So there is a famous, famous song. Well, maybe not that famous, depending how old you are, by Radiohead called Creep. And the chorus is, but I'm a creep, I'm a weirdo, what the hell am I doing here? I don't belong here. Well, that was my internal dialogue, I think, all the way through high school. Because that's what I said to myself over and over and over again. I'm not good enough, I'm too skinny, that girl won't like me, why do I have to have acne, blah, 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 blah. I point out basically every flaw to myself, whether I was looking in the mirror or not. Oh, I'll never accomplish that. She'll never like me. All the things that we say that get in the way. So I'm going to give you a little something that you can do, a little technique that you can do. Because it's really hard. People say, do positive thinking. Say positive things to yourself. She won't like me. Yes, she'll like me. Well, that's good, but that's a big kind of jump for people to do. So how about this? Next time you say something negative, think of what the opposite would be. But you're going to do something very special. You're going to say, what if? And what I mean by that is, if you're saying, hey, that person will never like me, what if they would? I'm never going to make it. What if I could? When you add what if in, you're telling yourself, hey, there's a possibility. Your brain has to represent it in a certain way. It becomes something that is a known. And we like knowns. We don't like unknowns. So what if I could do it? By the way, when it comes to saying stuff to yourself, don't say negative things to yourself. Don't say anything to yourself that if somebody walked up to you at a bus stop and said it, you'd want to smack them one right in the face. Keep the dialogue clean. Keep it good. And if you're saying something negative, remember a little tip. What if? That's something I tell my clients. That's something that you can do cognitively. That's why I point to my head cognitively. That you can do for your conscious mind. There's all different ways you can change and become more confident. But I'm going to give you some tips over the next five more days of seven days of confidence. And if you're interested in talking to me about working with me, talking to me about my online coaching programs, or just asking me questions about confidence, uh, put me down below. M E and I will message you and follow up. I hope you're all doing well and please share this and give me a comment if you find that this is helpful for you. You know, I'm doing this because I want my friends to get the benefit of what I've been doing. It's great changing people's lives. I love changing people's lives, but if I can't help my friends, what is the purpose? Thanks for watching. Uh, hey, Kenny Ehrenberg, Officer Ehrenberg. My mom always mentions you when I'm home. Uh, Dennis, hello, friend. Nice to see you. And whoever tunes in after this, remember this. Talk kindly to yourself when you're saying something negative. Say the opposite, but add it with what if. I'm going to be doing more of these little tips throughout the next uh, five days, so tune back in. And uh, peace out, as the kids say. <laughs>